Well, we talked about it before. Is uh, plastic shit here that's got to go. And I was going to wire wheel it up, but uh, tying the sole off a of Colorado K5. So I'll take the heat gun and a putty knife, and that'll come right up. So let's give it a try. Slot bucket. It's a lot better. A whole lot better than the ground wheel. God have mercy. They got a rather eight glass and they use a ground wheel again. Oh, yeah. right, here's the extension cord from a welder when it comes. It's a 12-2 Romex with 15 amp uh, receptacles on it. This is 22 gauge sheet and there's my nibbler. I'm getting ready to uh, cut this panel out so the weird. The reason I'm going to use a nibbler is you look how much uh, bow is put into the material when you use a cutoff wheel. It's just too much heat and I don't want to do all that. So I'm going to nibble it. 15, 16 gauge, 14 gauge. Cut off wheel works pretty good. Uh, 22 gauge you're going to nibble out. According to my plan, this piece is going to butt right here, and then I'll lay another piece here. And I'll show you in a second. Let me get my gloves on. This piece is going to butt like this. Be another piece to fill in this part right here. It won't be, won't need to be, but about this wide. And we'll bring that here. Alright. And then there'll be a, a gap here. And then we'll take another piece and lay it there like that and uh, tie it in. Here's where I uh, took a picture and printed it out. <coughs> and, uh, lay down the game plan how it's going to put these strips in there's a a roll right here that I can't duplicate because I don't have the equipment at this time I could have probably tack welded uh, a piece of steel on and rolled it up on a piece of the handrail pipe I had but uh, I don't have any oxycetylene right now my tanks are empty and I don't have a rosebud um, adapter I've only got a cutting and a welding tip so what I did I figured I was going to lay this in first, then this second, and then I can come back and measure this part here third. As it ends up, I will have to put a piece here and here. And then come back, I need a, a long piece to go here to butt up underneath here where there was some rust. This material down here is in good shape, but right here on this feathered edge is kind of rusted out. Let's get this tacked up first. Come on, God. Maybe after 
persuade it a little bit sometimes. <clears throat> Right now on this one it's a little bit more intricate. So what I'm gonna try to do is uh I'm gonna put the panels in that I need to fill in this void. And then I'm gonna um do the welding. Right now I'm just making putting them in and tacking them if it'll tack. <laughs> 